previously. But I don't want to see that gloomy face of yours no more. Don't ever come back here. And so we go. Hello friends, my name is Knight, and welcome back to Paper Mario! We are in uh, Glitzville, and I have yet to go inside this room right here. What we're going to do is take a look over here. I can't get that shine sprite. I have already tried. Make sure there's no hidden gems or anything. So let's go. How are you guys doing today? Oh, hello. Yo, out of the way, pal. I don't do stories on nobody. Sorry, move it or lose it. Move to one side, small fry. The only thing my camera shoots is famous athletes. Good for you. Welcome to the Clint's Pit. There's a guy over there who gets paid to say that, right? Boy, it's hard to find a guy that clean cut and responsible these days. <sighs> I sighed just thinking about him. Hey, what are you doing here? Oh, hello, Mr. Dash Dash. We're again. What are you doing here? How did you get to here? Welcome to the Glitz Pit. Your savage battles go on each day and every day. Hey, Mr. Mustache Guy, where's Prince Mush? Hi, we're here because my son is a big fan of the former champ, Prince Mush. But it looks like he's not around here anymore. And we came all this way to see him. Bit of a crying shame, really. Sorry, bud, but authorized people only pass this point. If you're looking to see a match, head on through the main doors. Okay. As we'll do that. Well, thank you. Just want to see what's around here. Guys! Well, hello there, you big, barely hunk of a man. You smashing deer. Not that I'm afraid I'm only interested in the champion, Rock Hawk. Tulu! Okay. Sorry, Bob, but all authorized people pa only pass this point. If you're looking to see a match, head on through the main door. Uh, thought you were over there. How did you get over here? We are twins. Oh, that makes sense. They're twins. <laughs> do, do, do. Hello. Hey, how you doing, bud? I'm a freelance cameraman. I'm always after a scoop. How do you know? I will go through the doors and then. Oh. Oh dear me, what a positively glamorous venue. Oh mercy Mario, look there, those two brutes are about to have at each other. Should have went in the bottom one first. That's right, Oh, I think it's about time for you to feel the rock! Oh, You can't jump on him, it hurts you, unless you have spike in there. Stay down Ben you don't want more of this, why'd you even show up? Yeah, you hear me talking with me. Stay out of the ring or fill the bird, baby. Tell you what, do about a million push-ups and then come see Uncle Rockhawk. I'll give you another world-class spanking and send you crying home to Mama again. Howie, champ! That was a great A whooping. Your thoughts on the match? You call that a match? Ain't there a fighter out there who can challenge me? No, no one can. You hear me? Ain't a fighter out there that can even make me sweat. They're all a bunch of little crybabies running around in stinky diapers. You got a bone to pick? Come fight me. Bring it. I'll take on anyone. You weakling, you might as well stick to video game fighting, okay? Because I'll hurt you. Yeah, number one, baby. Rock Hawk is the champ. <laughs> <coughs> oh, because the stars in your belt. Oh, my word, Mario. On that uncouth bird's belt. Is that a crystal star? It certainly is. Yes, I do believe it is. Oh, oh. Yes, I do believe it is. That wonderful sparkle is yet another crystal star. Well, it's such a tawdy place for it to find it. Why would it be here of all places? Audrey? I don't think I know that word. All right. Oh, whatever shall we do? I don't fancy the idea of stealing that fellow's belt. What shall we do, Mario? With the battle on wait in the top. Uh, I, will, I will fight everyone here and become the champion. I'm going to be a wrestler now. Fuck Peach. Oh, you dollar man. I'm so happy to hear you say that. I expect nothing less. You're ten times the man of anyone here. You'll be a champion in no time. Oh, yes. Let's move on then, shall we? Our next step is to become official fighters, I imagine. Oh, 
Ooh, my heart is positively thumping. Let's find out whoever is in charge this minute. Oh, yes, I'm going to be the best wrestler around. <laughs> you cannot go this way. Did I spit on you? I'm just doing a little primal screen therapy here. Rah! Yeah, ruin that loser! Don't always don't you always forget about your troubles when you're watching a good fight? Yeah, totally. I hear you talking, man. Awesome. I will become the cloud favorite. Why am I on the screen? Well, hello, Mr. Mustache. We meet again. Okay. How do I find who is in charge here? Uh, how do I become a fighter? What's that, Bob? You want to be a fighter? Hmm. Well, if you're serious, you better go meet with Mr. Grubba, the promoter. Mr. Grubba's office is just down the hallway. You can't miss it. Head on through. Oh, yeah, thank you. I don't think your twin would have let me through. This is a minor league locker room, bub. Sorry, you can't go in here. <coughs> Sorry, fighters only, bub. No one else admitted. I do wonder if you look alike. This is a major league locker room, bub. Sorry, you can't go in there. Oh, there's a uh, saver point in here. This is the champion's room. Only the champion may enter. Sorry, regulations. The locked door. What's that? You want to be a fighter, bub? All right, go on in. Mr. Grubba's just inside. I am going to uh, look around first. Safe point on this side, too. Minor league locker room. That's how I get out the door that way. Okay, so Mr. Grubba's place is at the end of the hall. in tarnation are you son and who let you win this is grubba's office yep that's me grubba and you're you you are one rude dude coming in without knocking uh, how about what to be a fighter what now an athlete huh you want to be a fighter yes please how we that do change a thing or two son i always got time for an up-and-comer yep this place is packed to the gills with young fighters all priming or raring to go I gotta say, son, you're a bit skinny for my taste, but I'm willing to give you a shot. You literally like Goombas and Clouds into this league, and I am an actual person. What do you want from me? Now play me straight, son. You want to live the glamorous life of a champ, don't you? Don't skip you. How do I do uh, your accent? Uh, darn skippy. I don't know. All right, all right, son. I hear where you're coming from, son. Loud and clear. I was just a poor pup. I didn't give a pokey spittoon for a fancy big city ways. But I jumped into the world of martial arts and found my way to fame and riches. And you know what I realized? Being rich and famous is the diggity day dynamite. Doug Dimido, owner of the Doug Zell Dimido. Now I can't mix it up in the ring no more, but I earned enough to set me for life. You're reading me here, son. Dreams do come true, even if they ain't yours exactly. Yep, that's the key, son. Dream big and you'll get big. That's the winner's way. And when you make it big, you'll look back at all those small dreamers and laugh. You reading me, son? Oh. I, uh, I don't... Yes? <laughs> That's the spirit chief. Now let's hear have a walk and talk. Come on now. I do not trust him for a second. I hope uh, you do not have a problem with me having a partner in the ring. Partners fight, you know. Game Boy Advance on the wall. Now, how do you like this, Pod? Just feast your eyes. Go on. This is the champion's room. Isn't it a sight? Deluxe. You become champ, son, and you'll get the key to this room. That ain't all, of course, is on top of the big money and screaming fans. Yeah, no doubt about it, son. Apply yourself in a life of wealth and comfort awaits. Okay. Now, uh, here we have the Major League locker room. A lot of contenders here. What you think, son, huh? Not exactly glamorous, but it's clean and comfortable. 
totally sanitary too. Maybe I'm old fashioned, but I care about my fighters, darn it. Now, I'm sure you know this already, son, but there ain't one world champion. Find your way to the top and taking the belts to become champion an easy thing. But that's the point, son. Wouldn't be worth it if there weren't no challenge. I can see you got the fire for it too, Pard. You got there and the eye of a tiger there. If you're gonna be a champ, I can just feel it. I ain't never been so sure about a fighter. Oh, hey, another one thing. You gotta sign an itty bitty contract to be a fighter. Ain't no thing, just a second or two of your time. Just jot your name here, okay? Sign up me up. You signed the contract. Terrifying. Best thing you ever done, son. Now, you're Mario. Ain't a bad handle. Still, I gotta say, Pard, it likes to punch as a fighter's name, get me? Let me see here. Bam! Hooey! I got it! From now on, you're gonna be the Great Gonzalez. Ain't that a beaut? Uh, you made to me a uh, Mexican. You know I'm an Italian, right? You know what? It doesn't even matter. Dang it, if that ain't a stroke of genius, it ain't that good comes around once in a lifetime. Yep, everyone will soon bow before the Great Gonzalez. Make me proud, son. Uh, okay. Well, now, we got the business side out of the way. Jolene, can you come in a minute, darling? You look like a normal secretary. Yes, sir, you wish to see me? Sure did, huh, Jolene? This is the great Gonzalez, our newest rising star. Be a peach and take him down to the minor league locker room, alrighty. Right away, sir. Mr. Gonzalez, if you would be so kind, please follow me. Oh, uh, you're talking to me. I am Gonzalez. Okay. <coughs> Let's go. As you know, you're a contracted fighter now, so you must abide by some rules. First and foremost, what Mr. Grubba says goes, period. You must do what he says. Also, as per your contract, you cannot quit until Mr. Grubba releases you. There are many other small guidelines that I will explain as they become relevant. Blech. Well, here we are. This is your locker room. Uh, this place is a little gross. You're starting in the minor league, of course, as you've just started your career. If you don't like this thing room, I suggest you work your way up through the ranks. If you're ready to fight, you just log on to this computer terminal here. Mr. Garbin will then decide who you match up against, so you have no say in this. Why don't you try it once? Walk up to the screen and log on with A. Hit pick reserve a match. Okay, I will do that. You are standing in my way. Welcome to the automated match reservation system. What is your command? I don't want to do anything yet. I want to look in all these lockers. Okay. Well, howdy, Gonzalez. Ready to get your fist dirty, huh? There you go, son. If, uh, I got a treat for you. Your first battle's gonna be against the Goomba Bros. Don't worry about them. They're just a piece of cake. Just mop them up, okay, son? Hey, we want to get everyone fired up, though, so appeal to the crowd at least once. You got any questions about detailed rules? Just ask the lovely Miss Jolene, okay, son? Well, good luck, pard. Okay, your battle is to serve. At this point, we'll just wait until security comes for you. Fighting is pretty basic. The team that drops the opponent's HP to zero first wins. If you beat an opponent who ranks above you, your ranking will go up. Then again, if you lose to a lower ranking opponent, your ranking will go down. Simply winning is not enough. When Mr. Grubb has sets fight conditions, follow them. In this case, the condition is to the appeal to the crowd at least once. Fairly easy. If you satisfy the condition to win, you can battle a higher ranked opponent next. If you get your rank up to 11th, you'll get a shot at the Major League. That's about all you need to know for now. Did you understand all of that? I think I got it. Okay, good. For now, just wait until security comes to get you, Mr. Gonzalez. Well, that was quick. Gonzalez, match time. Follow me, bub. Okay, security's here to escort you to the ring. Try not to get completely destroyed out there. Give me a second. I want to look around. Can I uh, hide in this locker? <laughs> I do believe I'll get out. Go out for my regular stroll soon. All right, mustache is a fighter. If you have any questions? Feel free to bomb ask me. I outrank you after all, bomb. Take care of yourself, dog. Don't make any rookie mistakes. You know what I mean. Nah, mean. Let's go. <sighs> Let's 
Squared off next, folks, are the Hoopin' Hardheads, the Goomba Bros. And a newcomer with a hankering for hammer, the Gray Gonzalez. The Goomba Bros have been waiting to get all head up for the fight. Let's check in. How do you do, Goomba Bros? How you feeling today? Y'all ready for this fight? Ha! Are you kidding, ma'am? We're always ready to mark a full two. Where's this Gonzalez from here? Talking idiot, that's who. Just waiting makes us mad. We're going to teach this tardy punk how to respect fighters for seniority. I think maybe you ought to call an ambulance for him now, just to save time later. Hot oh, diggity day, fan fans. This is a great Gonzalez now striding up on you. I would tell you, this rookie's got some guts strolling up here late like he owns the place. Whew. Okay, now, Gonzalez, listen up. Let me just explain the rules of the match real quick. How about a bonk bunk? What sort of base coward's attack before the light match officially begins? Honestly, come on, Mario Darla. We shan't lose these old laughs. Let's teach them a lesson. Ah, quit crying, Willie. That was just a little welcome gift for the rookie. Where's our thank you? I wasn't sure if Mario had a pill or if it could be any of the characters. The Great Gonzalez wins. Tell me, son, what's that like? Your first taste of victory, like? Hmm. That's a battle with Savage. I'll tell you what I just saw, folks. A whooping. This kid's got skills. We got ourselves a new hero. Let's hear it for him, folks. Yeah, the Great Gonzalez. Getting hyped up for this one. <laughs> All right. Well, Gonzalez, that fight wasn't a total loss. But listen, son, fighters got to play the crowd, you know? Pump them up more. I hope you'll give me more razzle-dazzle next time, huh? We understand each other? Good. I'll be on my way then. Mr. Jolene, he'll give you your fight money. See ya. I oh, wait. I get the money for this. That's awesome. Here's your fight money, Mr. Gonzalez. You got three coins. Mario's ranking rose to 19. Cool. Next fight will be set, not be set until you select reserve match on the terminal. You can also check your current ranking on the terminal screen. Feel free to do what you like until your next fight. You have a nice day, Mr. Gonzalez. Okay, can I uh, take a nap? I need to rest. Yo, Rook, how was your first fight, dog? I'm King K, man. Just a bush league scrub like you. Come mean you, man. You look like a straight up dude. I think I can hang with you. Hey, so why don't you beat the gang, huh? This guy here is Master Crash. Nice to meet you, bum. Well, now that we've gotten to know each other, I will give you advice, bum. As Mr. Lean was saying, you better bum obey Mr. Glover's conditions. If you clear the conditions to win, you'll get to fight the higher rank foes, bum. If you can't clear them, your bum will end up battling a lower ranked fighter, bum. You can't climb the bum ranks to fighting the bottom of the bear, bum, bum. Yeah, my man's got you next to speech issues, but he got good advice sometimes. Not just sometimes, Bomb. Advice is always useful, but Bomb. Right, man, whatever. Anyway, this sleep machine over here is Bandy Andy. Heh, <laughs> nice to meet you. I'm not in here too often, but when you see me around, say hi. Oh, yeah, if you sleep in the bed over there, your HP and FP will fully recover. It's not like the cushy's bed in the champ room, though. It still doesn't refill star power. Okay, cool. This last guy here with sweet purple kicks is known as Clefter. Ah, Clefter likes to make friends with Mustache. Easy that cleft dog. Do date with the friendliest guy, but you get used to him. Anyway, that's the core of the minor league, man. You need something to ask us. Oh, yeah, I almost forgot. You and me gotta eventually square off, so good luck, man. I'm not going to refill my HP and FP. <laughs> yeah. That jump of yours is just insane. Double G money, you got mad timing. 
I'm always looking for the best bomb -bom to blow myself up in the ring. We should think of how to make our rooms look bomb cool as well, Gonzalez. As fighters, our job is to entertain the crowd, bomb. Oh yeah, I have to like do special tricks and shit. Ah, right, no closer. <laughs> I do believe I'll go out for a regular stroll soon. Okay, I think I'm going to get another fight. Well, my boy had a gun, so let's fix it for a fight, huh? Well, all right, and then let me just see here. Your next opponent will be right to 18 in the glitz pit, the KP Coopers. Now, listen, son, in this battle, I want you to avoid using any of them, their special moves. I think the crowd's craving for a nice long battle at its simplest and finest. Now get in there and don't and don't do, go a grandstanding. Hey, dog. Looks like your next match is against me. Good luck, man, to both of us. Oh, yeah, I have to wait for security. Gonzalez, match time. Follow me, bub. I was gonna save, I forgot. It's alright, I'll save after this fight. Why is this one of you in the locker room? No special moves, sir. For our next battle, we got the merciless execution of the great Gonzalez and the shell machine to doom. Yep, a fight to the finish with the KP Coopers. I'll try not to get in your way, Mario. Me and my peeps can tell this. I told you we were going to square off, and now it's on. Get yourselves ready to battle! Where'd the fucking gong come from? <laughs> Alright, don't use any special moves. I can do that. Oh. Is this kind of special? Woo, stylish. Ah, I can't be stylish with him. Okay. Just a break dance. Oh. I see. Okay. Didn't quite work out like how I thought it did. <laughs> we got ourselves a winner, the great Gonzalez. Did it, Mario. Wow. Indeed, though, we did. Here's your fight, buddy, Mr. Gonzalez. We're going. Yeah. I'm here, excuse me, I must be going. Hey, way to hand out a beat down there, man. He beat me straight up. Could have swing the other way next time, though. You know what I'm saying? Ah, so this is all my sack, Scott. Do you always follow the conditions set by the promoter? If you don't, you'll never get any bomb matches with higher ranked fighters. Man, you see them, they, they find shorties out there in the front. You wanna talk to them, dog. Get some digits. Uh, maybe. Actually, I need to heal first, and then I will go save. <laughs> okay. Let's go save. But it should be a... Yeah, it's a right here. Which side I'm on? Okay. Alright. I think this is a great place to leave this episode. So thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in the next episode of whatever I decide to make. Good night, setting out.